Welcome back to Star Wars. Uh, myself and Cal are here. Hello, Cal. Hey, 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 hey. So that was uh, Cal's class quest that we've uh, just finished up. And, uh, that was a lot of fun. Cal's class quest does take him up to the spaceport to finish off. But before we do that, my class quest is not too far away. So we're going to go dash off and do that. Let's go and get spotted by mobs. Uh, that wasn't us. Good. I did wonder. So, where we're heading is uh, slightly off to the side here, and doesn't really have much to do with this whole Republic thing that's going on at the front, unlike Kalas Class Quest, which uh, had a lot of tie into the Balmora series. Mine's about the Oh, why don't you uh, remind us uh, where, where we're up to in your class quest since we're almost going in? Oh, absolutely. Yep. So, the main gist of my class quest right now is I'm hunting artifacts of Tulak Horde, uh, which is an old Sith warrior. Uh, before we can go in, um, I've actually got to inject myself. But, uh, yeah, so we've tracked down... Uh, artifacts already in uh, Drummond Cast, and now our second artifact is is here, uh, past all these Killix. But to get through to the Killix, I've had to get myself a serum so that I could. They're not Killix, are they? I thought they were. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe. Thought Killix were an older one. Anyway, um, aren't you going to inject me as well? Uh, this uh, is for both. It's considered for both. It says inject your oh. annual group mates. Or colicoids if they're not killix. Maybe that's what I was... That's the one, colicoids. I'm thinking killix. Oh, overload them off the thing, see what happens. Oh yeah, that's right. Oop, wrong button. That's the one I was trying to go for. There you go. Out of combat, both dead. Cool. That's one out of ten. There's a few to kill. There'll be plenty of them to do. So just got to work our way down here. Just a lot of weaving in and out. Um, I d don't know if this one will work so well, but... Possibly not. I think I've just no. everything. Everything, indeed. Um, I don't think our pets are close by either. Oh well. Oh no, we're out of combat. We'll take out these down here, just... I'm gonna want the... the kill count. Although, is that guy evading a little bit? Maybe a touch. There we go, I'm also gonna take this guy out at the very back. Thankfully I've sorted out my keybinds a little bit, so... Hopefully, the sound will stop cutting out, that kind of thing. Um, mostly because my mouse uses control thing, uh, uh, control modifiers to be able to uh, use its abilities. But when I step backwards, is the button S. Control S together eliminates all sound in WoW. Uh, wow, in Star Wars, should I say? Sorry. <laughs> mm -hmm. See, a part of the uh, issue that we were having previously is... You have to excuse me, I'm going to be doing some... Um, corpse killing him. Be doing some what, sorry? Corpse killing of a uh, gathering, sorry. See if there's any ah, straws. Yeah. Okay, so I believe the first part of this is I've got to defeat this broodmaster. Very tricky solo, so you need to watch out for that. And he does spawn a lot of ads from these pools. Um, so hopefully Kala can take care of the ads a little bit. And Do what? You're going to want to help me with these ads. 
Yeah, sure. Just come in the middle. Yep. Okay, and this guy again. Again, on solo, this was actually really tricky. This guy does actually quite a lot well, of damage and stuns and things, but for us, it wasn't, it's not an issue at all. I recall on my main, I had trouble with this. Yeah, and Ken Vile was completely stunned out for most of that. Uh, that's an interesting one, which is not as good as my channeling saber, so just greed that. And our artifact that we're after is up here. Uh huh. doing I'm taking my artifacts looking very similar to a datacron although it's not well in, in that it's square and it glows absolutely also similar to a holocron in that respect then isn't it <laughs> yeah Okay, and I just need to use this holocom call, which you should be in on. Go for it. Say hi to your master for me. I believe so. Oh, I get to see as well. Uh, I mean, my lord. I mean, Major Irren here, sir. Ah. Uh -oh. Got a promotion, eh? Yes, After thank you. Got Major Bessica. After I killed Major Bessica. Yes, uh... As the new resources officer here on Balmora, I just wanted to apologize for the behavior Becoming. of the late Major Bessica. He was an idiot. His son's mission was not a military matter, and the Major had no right to demand your valuable time in that way. I couldn't agree more. I just hope you remember my role in helping you find what you were after. No. You got your promotion. I don't know what else you want from me. You'll always be welcome here on Balmora, sir. A Sith is welcome wherever he goes. Absolutely. No question of it. It's a pleasure to serve. Well, uh, good luck with, with whatever it is you're doing. Now they're no longer calling me slave. Now I demand respect. Yes. You are gaining in power. Young Fire Lash. Fire Weaver. Weaver. <laughs> So uh, we'll fight our way, our way out here, and uh, uh, we've got to return to Colonel Vrain, um, which probably means it's somewhere near Darth Lacris uh, as well, isn't it? But I'm trying to remember where everyone was. So we'll uh, end up indeed quick travelling. I think could tr quick travel. But it's probably worth doing now, isn't it? Okay, let's quick travel. Uh, up probably. To the. Sundari Where do we want to go? To the. Sundari Imperial Outpost. Ah. Uh -huh. But usually you'd fight through here and there'll be an exit. You said fight now, Zash, yeah? Well. Not Zash. What's this governor's name again? I forget her name. Darth Lacris. Lacris, yeah. Darth Luscious. <laughs> yeah, uh. Now about uh, who gets her, alright? Well, we'll see, we'll see. So let's uh, head down these. Most evil Sith wins. Oh, that's not fair, you got more dark side points than me. God, you're in a rush, aren't you? You've not seen some action in a while <laughs> or something? <laughs> this, uh, it's been a little while. It uh, has. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Calf, calf. Calf, this way. I don't worry. I'm not, I am not. I won't be mean. Uh? Oh, yeah. We've got to chat to the fat man, haven't we? Yeah. He's not as interesting a person. 
<laughs> Afraid not. I've heard most satisfactory <laughs> reports of your success in the Balmoran Arms Factory. And that fool Vol Argon played right into our hands. There can be no doubt. The resistance is crushed. The Balmorans now know better than to challenge the Empire. The Sith are our true secret weapon, without a doubt. Captain Rigel is in charge of writing up the report on this one. If I could ask you for one final favor, that you report your success to him. Okay, Captain Rigel's right near the spaceport, so that can wait. Okay. Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Let battle commence. Darth Lacris. I'm on with good Grand Marshal Chiquetta is defeated, and the Balmoran arms factory <laughs> is broken. You smell like smoke and blood. I'm Can good looking. Oh yeah. I've got horns and everything. On Just as your whole Senate and the Supreme Chancellor, better. I wholeheartedly condemn the actions of these rogue soldiers on Balmora. They struck at Imperial targets without any Republic support. The Senate values its peace treaty with the Empire. So embarrassing for the Senate, forsaking their own people. Meanwhile, Imperial intelligence has begun interrogating our captives. I'm giving the Jedi to Darth Ma to see if they can be turned. Your enemies are beaten. Oh. Your position is secure. <laughs> but our partnership doesn't have to end there. Bold, perhaps, and even tempting. But other duties call. Oh, I'm gathering troops for a down. clean sweep of the Balmoran Arms Factory. What? I'm making it my base of planetary operations. No. My governorship would be very different without you. You have my gratitude for your assistance. Uh, what? Next time you need assistance, let me know. I have skills you haven't seen. God, that just... I came off desperate there. That's I awful. No right, I've, I've just cock-blocked myself Could and no doubt. On Balmora? Perhaps I'll call on you again. No, she's just a tease. Yeah, I'm afraid it didn't quite work out for you. I'm going to pick up a, an upgrade for Kimball here. So I'm just gonna do. Um, yeah, I just got one for that. There we go. Excellent. Now, normally when you do that class quest uh, or that planetary quest, it's possible to. Um, have a bit of a bedroom moment with her, but because we were sharing the flirtatious comments, it didn't actually. Activate. She couldn't decide and didn't want to do both of us at the same time. That's right. She was afraid. We should kill her now for being afraid. <laughs> so yeah, that did, didn't quite work out to plan. No. I don't think romance is necessarily my uh, my guiding drive. Oh no! Give me the lift! Oh no, no! See ya! Oh. oh, I take it it's the rules is those who are left behind stay behind. Oh, absolutely. Well, those who stay behind are left behind. So, we're going to be finishing off on this planet and heading to... Nar Shaddai, you saw there was a ton of stuff Playing that we missed. Authorized destinations. In particular, there's some blank spots on my map. And these three blank spots are... Well, up here in this blank spot where I'm showing, there is a... Uh, let me see if I can show you. Uh, about here-ish on the map where my cursor is, there is a vendor. And that vendor sells you an item. And you use that item by taking it to... A K, uh, no, a, a thing on the bridge over here, and that gives you a datacron on the bridge. So that's where the datacron is for that one. I won't.
be able to remember where all of them are by the way but anything I can remember off the top of my head I'll uh, say on camera we won't be getting it but at least not on camera we'll be do that off screen later on um, yeah but for now Nar Shaddaa is our destination and well I've got to kill a Jedi mate oh, wanna come oh yeah I wouldn't miss it for the world although let's report to Captain Nigel um, who actually is the same guy who, who tells you about these Balmora uh, bonus missions I think or at least the guy next to him Again, we'll be skipping these bonus missions, there's no need for us to do it. We're high enough level for Narshadar. At least I think so. Although while I'm here, I'm travelling in, um, I'm going to go see the trainer. I have a few abilities available for, to me. So, I'm just going to dash over there. That seems fair. I think level-wise, um, we're level 21. You can enter Narshadar, is it, from level 20 is advised? Yeah. At last. Or if you want to take longer disciple. over it, that's absolutely fine too. Why not upgrade for dark infusion? Nice. More hills. Be gone. Um I don't, yeah, let's report to the captain first and then we'll go do your class quest. Then I'll go quickly show my hollow terminal call. You'll have to probably give us an an update as well. This Captain Laverse here, he's uh, the guy that gives you the bonus missions. Now that I remember. Oh, that's correct. I believe so. And Captain Rigel was the first person we spoke to when we entered Balmora. He's also going to be one of the last people we speak to. I believe he's going to thank us, kiss our asses. Well, this is certainly a yes. happy day for all of us, isn't it? The whole resistance is in shambles. The people's spirits are broken. Balmora is as good as ours. They were pushovers. They deserve to be conquered. <laughs> the Empire agrees. We cannot possibly thank you enough for your service. Decades we've been trying to win this war, and you've done it in a fraction of the time. Thank you. They love us! Yay! Parties for all! And this is an upgrade of my force focus, so I'll take that and equip that. These things, these implants and Ooh. stuff and relics, they come later. We'll grab some later. Fill those out. Now if you do, do decide to do the bonus series on this planet, guys, then you'll find it's rather extensive. So if you like Balmora and like the way it looks, then I do recommend the bonus series. It's got its own plot in there, which is... It's okay. It's not it's not super compelling, but it's uh, it's alright. Um, and yeah, recommend doing it if you enjoy Balmora. Yeah, I enjoyed the bonus or series. Or if you find yeah. yourself a bit under level. Yeah. Didn't quite do all of it, though, myself. I did most of it. Um, now... I think, if I remember correctly, there might actually be a datacron on this spaceport. Mm, that's... is it in Balmora? I know there's one on Korriban space, not Korriban, Drum and Cast. Oh, it might be the... I might be confusing the two. You could be right, but without checking up. You're too late, Sith. I already transmitted the Jedi conversation like between you and Commander Rylon to the Jedi Council. Noman Carr has his proof. Now Master Carr and his Padawan will track down and expose every Sith agent in the galaxy. I'll let you enjoy your delusions. Enjoyment is not part of the equation. It's not part I of the Jedi way. Of purpose. I seek neither thrills nor satisfaction. Unlike you, I am calm. What? I'm fucking welcome! Unlike me, How dare she? Dead. If you persist to in be this fair, I shall be forced to strike Sith code does not promote the dark calm. Side shall fail you, Sith. It promotes Save passion. Yourself, surrender, and the Jedi Council will give you every opportunity to discover redemption. 
Save your breath, Jedi. You're going to need it. Attack me and I will kill you. Huh. I got three mates. Who have you got? Oh yeah, only three of my companions. For some reason not here. Oh hang on, where's mine? <laughs> Just the two of us I'm afraid, old boy. No worries, old thing. Okay, I'll refresh this. And I'm gonna put a shield up on myself, drop myself a hot, and probably a direct seal as well, just in case. She's doing a bit of damage. Got our companions. Drop another hot on me. There we go. <laughs> Uh, actually, yeah, I did miss you, Vet. For a change. She's got a new cloak, by the way. Do you not need to speak oh, no, to uh, this Jedi Knight Marshmallow here? I do, I was just... I was just... talking to Vet. Your victory means nothing. The damage has been done. The proof has been transmitted. So deal the death blow, Sith. I am at peace, knowing that the greater good has been served. I hate to burst your bubble, Jedi. No, that's a lie. I'm reveling in it. <laughs> I intercepted your transmission. The Jedi know nothing. I, I, I like his callous side. It's good. You just earned your pay, Lieutenant. I'm only doing my job, my lord. I had her monitored and screened the entire time. There was never any risk at all. Gloat all you like. It means nothing. I remain at peace. And Noman Carr and his Padawan will still defeat you. Tell me the name of Noman Carr's Padawan. I will never betray her identity. I am resigned. Strike me down. I offer no further resistance. I will savor your destruction. I knew it. There is no death. There is the Force. Another part of the Jedi Code. It's yeah, a bit. Well. <laughs> How bizarre. She just closed her eyes and accepted death. Malavai Queen's a bit of a pussy, though. No matter. The threat is ended. Lord Barris will be anxious to learn what became of this. When you're ready, I'll contact him from my office. I'm anxious to get off this planet. Excellent. I'll go prepare. I'll be waiting in my barracks. Right, got to head to the barracks. Oh, okay, so back out onto the planet again, is it? Indeed. It's not very far, it's just uh, the general meeting point we've been using, if you recall. Yeah, I mean, at some point we're going to end up skipping a tiny bit of your storyline on camera unfortunately because I can't watch the story that happens on your ship even if I entered your ship which I know is possible but that's correct yeah we've tested it out a couple of times uh, that's right yeah we can time. we can get into the ship but we can't enter the the conversation yeah it's 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 curious because I mean it's for co-op play it's more or less integrated but there are a few areas where certainly a little bit of improvement um, can be made yeah I think they should have realised that there'll be times yeah you know, there's gaps in the storyline but oh well hopefully they'll sort that out ok we have to wait for Caliph as I force ran most of the way. Here we go. Here we go. With your friend Malavai Kin Quinn. I don't have any friends, apart from you. It's not my place, oh. Lord Barris. I leave that for your apprentice to convey. I love you too, man. Then step aside, Lieutenant. My apprentice <laughs> has arrived. <laughs> Nice of you to join go us. Too far. Quinn refuses to <laughs> update me, insisting the privilege be yours. I assume the Jedi investigator has been stopped. 
She is dead, Master. That is a relief. Ooh. I had hoped to avoid confronting the Jedi, but our hand was forced. What matters most is that Rylon can no longer be exposed. And how would you assess Lieutenant Quinn's contribution? You're loving him, aren't you? He did his part. Lieutenant, my apprentice's demeanor notwithstanding, I have been impressed with your efforts. You have more than made up what is owed to me. I'm putting you up for Do you not think Lord Barris, Darth Barris, looks a bit like Cartman? You station wherever you choose. You are dismissed. Well, wow. he's Thank given you, him a bit. Barris. If my actions benefit the Empire, they benefit me. I would have done the same regardless of our past. My Lord, before I depart, it's been my extreme honor to serve you. You are the epitome of everything the Empire stands for. Do you guys need a I know. I'm great. I think you Thank guys you need a room. Sing, Quinn. Ooh. Until we <laughs> I salute you. <laughs> Love is in the air. And there's Darth Barris. <laughs> Every time I go around. But if Quinn can overcome them and rise to the station he deserves, there is great hope for our Imperial allies. If given the opportunity, he will excel. By the way, it's not worth worrying about. Quinn's affairs are a speck compared to what we face. Your presence on Balmora is no longer needed. Return to your ship when you're ready to leave. I'll contact you there. So, yeah, Barris is definitely right. can't move. On to our next exercise in domination and destruction. We don't have to leave to have an exercise in domination. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Point taken. Sure hope the next place we land on has a place to buy painkillers. <laughs> she mustn't like you very much. <laughs> Poor Vet. Um... I, yeah, I don't, uh, my points with her are never great. Um, no, 475 I have. So, so, do you not agree? Do you not think that he looks rather like Cartman? Who? No one. Darth Barris. Um, no. Well, if, Do if Cartman was a Sith Lord, he'd be Darth Barris. There's a certain amount of that. The voice doesn't really work, though. Oh, besides the voice. Oh, Caliph's mum's a bitch. She's the biggest bitch in the whole wide world. On Monday, she's a bitch. On Tuesday, she's a bitch. On Wednesday, she's a bitch in the whole wide world. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I, I just... I just... Uh, uh, you spoke to my mother in such a way. I don't know how I can survive. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, I'm not a bounty hunter anymore. Sorry, this way. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, which which space book, which dock are you going to? Hang on. Yeah, because I'm not an inquisitor anymore. Okay, we'll just finish up this episode by uh, taking my holo call and say, unfortunately, Cal's gone in there and I cannot... F well, I can follow, but I won't see his story, so... Uh, in a short while we'll uh, catch up well perhaps on the next episode you can start off the episode explaining what just happened yep fair enough um, forget the way in now is it this way yeah okay I have to say the uh, actually the ship that we both I can explain is pretty huge. I can explain just now before um, Malavar Quinn's just come up to me and he's begging an audience. So uh, I've informed him that begging doesn't really uh, do very well for me. Sure. See, I'll wait then. He's uh, reminding me that Lord Lord Barris enabled his reassignment uh, to anywhere he choose. Okay. Apparently, I've reawakened his ambition. Oh yeah. <laughs> Much profanity. Oh, sorry, profound. Uh, in a profound way, not profanity way. <laughs> um, 
So, like, uh, I'm I'm happy he thinks so highly of me. I'm backing up against the wall as we speak, however. Uh, more plaudits. Oh my god, he's getting on his knees. He's waist high. <laughs> <laughs> um, um. <laughs> he's he's begging to join me. He's telling me how good a pilot and strategist, and apparently he's a deadly shot. He'll be a tireless and loyal subject. He's offering his prowess and every ounce of his strength to our cause. <laughs> right, okay. Caliphant I just quit. said uh, he he'll fit somewhere. Okay. He is now my bitch. So, yeah, that's... Uh, Thank you, sorry about that. That's all right. That was terrible commentary. No, that's all right. Uh, that's Calaf's second companion, third companion, if you include 2VR8. Uh, we, we don't talk about 2VR8. No. He just... no. I okay. kicked him out of an airlock. Enough said. So, so <laughs> I'm in front of my ship's hollow terminal, and I'm going to see what my class quest brings. When it loads, here it comes. I found the artifact. Excellent. I trust Major Bessica. Well, you could all stick the kettle on with a load screen. I've well, they have gotten a bit quicker. Adar, but I'm still trying to locate I'll the other two. I'll see what I can learn while you're on Narshada. Now hurry. There can be no gain without haste. Okay, so uh, she's basically said, hurry up to Narshada. It's uh, pretty easy. Uh, we've get an upgrade for both Kenval and ED7, which is our droid 2VR8. Was part here. We can also select one reward. Now one of these is a nice power enhancement or crit enhancement. I think uh, I'm gonna go for. I can't remember which is which for healers. I'm gonna crit enhancement. I think that sounds fun. More crit for me. And uh, the way you equip these mods, although I think I've shown it in another another way, is I find an item that is moddable, say this thing. And I swap this 11 endurance here for this 14 and 4. And overwrite it's fine. And done. Again, same as you, I've been sent to just, you know, good job Balmar apprentice, bugger off to Nastradar. And kill me more people. Brilliant. Well, on the next episode, we'll be on Narshada. Join us then. This is an addendum, <sighs> very quickly. You've Sorry. reached Narshada safely. Good. Don't let the glittering towers fool you. Misery and desperation rule the slums below. And desperation can drive people to many things. Remember that in your attempts to recover the artifact here. Sorry, just to explain, I uh, cut down that last episode, and then I was travelling to Narshadar thinking all well and good, and then the storyline cut in. So, uh, before we lose any storyline, I've restarted the video again, just so you've got the end here. You believe I can use these people's hopelessness against them? Their need for answers should serve you well. The artefact, a pendant called the Eye of Tulak, belongs to the Sith Lord Palladius. He's lived here many years, converting Narshadar's poor and suffering into zealous followers. His own cult. He leads a cult of idiots. They won't stop me. Of course not, but they still must be dealt with. Palladius leads his cult from seclusion, but you can draw him out. I've contacted two of his former cult members. They're in hiding now, feeling back to pollution, but hungry for revenge. They should prove useful. I'm certain they will. I have encouraged their cooperation with the assurance that once Palladius is gone, the cult is theirs to lead. Circumstances change, of course. 
Do whatever you feel is necessary with Palladius and his cult. The artifact is all that matters. Okay, sorry about that. Um, yeah, now that really is the end of the video. So yeah, see you next time.